Good morning. I am Jay Shalini B from Final Year BC Department. We have uh, done a final year project on the UFA government and our title is Disable Disability Process for Common Good morning. I am Jay Shalini from Final Year BC. Good morning, our title is Design of Risk by Processor on FPG. I am the project is to define and implement the risk by processor on FPG and to analyze its power and media. So we have done about six literature surveys. The first one is high performance for microarchitecture based on risk by NAC for low power application. And in this paper, we have learned about how the postage pipeline has been implemented in the top seven FPG group. And, uh, in this, uh, we got 7,617 units. The second literature survey is towards a modular risk by based many core architecture for FPG oscillators. In this paper, the core architecture is designed for FPG platform at it as it has high performance, low visibility, flexibility, and energy efficiency. And this is implemented on the bricks at the scale plus. The third literature survey is a real-time capture state channel attack detection system and the simple type of order processor. In this paper, a real-time detection approach for matching side channel attacks such as spectrum on the simple processor. And uh, we got the uh, sorry, we got the accuracy of more than 99 percentage. So next paper is optimized implementation of SM4 and Lego microcontrollers discovery processor or ARM processor. In this paper, uh, 64-bit ARM processor and 32-bit risk of processor are implemented and they achieve 128.8 cycles per byte. The next literature summary is a receiver vector processor with simultaneous switching switched capacity DC to DC converters with 38 nanometer FPS level. In this paper, a risk of vector that uh, microcontroller implemented in 28mm FPSY with fully integrated simultaneous switching switch to capacitor DC to DC converter and um, they achieved uh, 80 to 86 percentage of efficiency. In the next paper is developing a multiple platform utilizing open display processor. In this literature uh, scenario, a multi core platform utilizing open display board is designed and uh, the the TC, the temporary capture is proposed in this paper, and this method improves the performance of a multiple platform by enabling caching of data. So, next is the proposed idea to design a risk of processors, CPU core, and to reduce the power in media using pipeline concept. So, the first one is a four stage pipeline CPU core. And this four stage to pipeline CPU core, when compared to the five stage and six stage, we got a very less number of LEDs on power consumption because in this four stage we have uh, only minimum units of uh, units pipeline, units execution unit. So it, uh, it has very less number of LEDs when compared to five stage and six stage. So due to this simplicity, we have moved to the five stage. So next one is the five stage pipeline, which includes instruction fetch, decode, instruction execution memory access and drive back. Uh, when compared to the four stage instruction unit, instruction execution unit, additional to VAU, it has load store, divider and multiplayer. So when compared to five, four stage pipeline to CPU code, five stage pipeline CPU code, code has very large number of LDPs. Uh, so we move to the six stage pipeline. In 6 stage pipeline code, additionally we added instruction pre-decode. This instruction pre-decode is used to uh, reduce the cycle time. Uh, so in order um, in 5 stage pipeline, at the stretch, only 5 instructions can be handled. But in case of 6 stage pipeline, we can handle up to 6 uh, instructions. And in this instruction execution unit, we added additionally branch prediction unit and divider. So these are the instruction fetch, uh, pre-decode, decode, execution, and uh, memory access, write back. Uh, these are the six-stage pipeline uh, we have implemented our video code. These are the models and results. 
for fetch, for decode, for execution, for uh, random execution we have layering, branch unit, divider, load speed unit, and multiplier. So after that it has memory access uh, screenshot and write box screenshot. Um, when we implemented it on the body, we got the four stage pipeline CPU code, which is uh, which consumption of area is very much less when compared to five stage. So, this is the five stage um, area consumption of uh, five stage pipeline in uh, Rivado, and this is the execution uh, results of six stage. So, uh, already six stage pipeline is existing. So when compared to the existing one, we have changed to the multiplier module by ourselves and we have implemented it on the model. So when we, the existing has a, a, a radio level of a um, little more than our uh, modified one. So we have showed it in our uh, table. So this is our uh, modified one. So then we uh, have uh, the existing one has a negative of number 1626 but the module has 1498 which is the increment of 7.87% and our power consumption is uh, for 4 states it is total launch coverage 0.1 or 2W junction temperature 25 5.5 uh, so, C terminal module is 74.53 and the uh, high stage result is total launch coverage 23.565 watt and junction temperature is 72.8 Celsius and terminal module is 12.2 Celsius and 6 stage pipeline total launch coverage is 24.083 watt junction temperature is 59.9 Celsius and terminal module is 40.1 Celsius. So, the hardware used is Rodelson Vivado FPG. So this is our submission of journal. Have uh, submitted our uh, submitted our paper on our uh, IEP International Conference India 2023. These are the these are the comments we got in zero preview first review second review and this is the comment we got in common review. So these are the documents we have got here. Thank you.